But yeah, the next set of characters is going to be um, more Tamadachi focused. I figured this set is the imposter set. The set of new characters that you could all come to know and love and feel just weird by them existing. So the cast of the town, there's Iwata in one of the roles. And I'm not really okay with that. A couple people were telling me it, it's it's not gonna be it, it's not gonna be a good matchup. There we go, Batman. Please, I keep jumping at every little noise. Oh really? Then I probably shouldn't do this. Do what? That didn't freak you out. Was it supposed to? Yeah, I agree. Mike Stoklaus is still like the only weird choice for me so far. Everything else has been pretty good because he's like a real person. The only character that I thought might make a good replacement would be Lumberjen. Sometime in between last time and now, Mike Stoklaza from Red Letter Media was infected by a gen. I love the, um, I love the five o'clock shadow. That is a nice touch. I think that that's, that's damn... Yeah, the mouth could be a little lower, but I th that's, that's pretty damn... That's pretty damn perfect. Yeah, I like... He's just growing his first facial hair. I think I'm okay with that. What's the war... We'll leave it endless trash for now. It's like the remnants of his previous personality. The stubble is from when he was Mike. Well, one more potential change. <laughs> I'm sorry, well... Here's the thing, Mike Stoklaus's me was a little on... This side. Maybe the character needs to lose the weight. Maybe it starts like this, and then later on ends up like this because the Jen's body is metabolizing and adapting to its new environment. He's tall. Well, he's- yeah, he's kind of tall compared to some of the other- I, I didn't realize how short Speed Luigi and Hotel Mario were. Lumberjan died, and Mike was near him when he died, so he ended up getting, like, some scraps of lumber on him when he ended up taking him over. Lumberjan is now a peaceful Jen and a helpful John, but he had no choice but to take over Mike's body. So he had to use him as a new host. But Mike was so fed up with this fucking world, and he was just like... that he was totally okay with it. He was just like, wow. You know, after this, he was just done. He was like, fuck it. Just take it. Yeah, all those Tamadachi fans are getting fucking... they're just creaming right now. They are creaming. Long Lost Brothers. They didn't even know each other up until just now. The transformation... is beginning. It's a, it's a wonder Speed Luigi can eat anything, considering his tongue is out of his mouth most of the time. I wonder if Speed Luigi, like, eats his tongue as well, and then, like, a new one grows back, kind of like, um, the tail of a... What is it, a salam salamanders grow their tails back? <laughs> one, one of them there, lizards. Hotel Mario wants some cotton gloves. Th those are fucking Mario gloves. Those are perfect. Sweet whispers. Telling enemy a little white lie to distract it. Let's let's see what that looks like on the cobra. Tee hee. <laughs> oh no. Hello there. They call me the prodigious postman. It's Crom from Fire Emblem. I have a letter addressed to a Mr. Vinisos. Krom, you look silly. Dear Vinisauce, I have decided to relinquish one of my father's choice snacks to you to aid your journey. Stay safe from Lamb Chop. Rhinoceros beetle specimen. Huh. What a thoughtful gift, Speed Luigi. How much um, do you think that would sell for if I sold it to, say, Tom Nook? Yeah, me and Jen are making close friends. Again, he's a reformed Jen. He, he's, you know, he, he feels bad for the sins of his race. He just wanted to become human more than anything. You know, he loved the way humans created, you know, art and music. When he inhabited the body of Mike Stoklaza, he realized, I've made a terrible mistake. Everything sucks. Bah. Lumberjen, a bro? Did you fall into a hole? Are you okay? I'm fine. You go on ahead without me. That's- that's okay, I guess? Wait, what, really? We'll meet you at the inn. What the fuck? 
Did you toot, Vine? <laughs> Hotel Mario, who's directly behind my character, just said, Did you toot, Vine Sauce? I, I did toot, by the way, yes, that's correct. Time for a new look! Oh! I'll be back in a sec! Ta-da! You... are a beautiful princess. Uh-oh. Good impression. No! <laughs> Lumberjen, you're becoming more like your father. Ah, uh, I'm beat. Can we take a break? Shh. Keep making so much noise and something will hear. What was that? See? No, I didn't. It wasn't my fault. Oh shit, the dreaded cow cave. Sorry, cave cow. <laughs> oh, this thing is mad. It's coming from deeper inside. It's gonna... It's gonna milk all of us. The revenge. Lumberjan cares. See what I mean? Oh, shit. Yeah, there's- there's something... there- <laughs> oh, no! I'm not making it flesh-colored. There's something very demented about this particular outfit. I see that Waluigi genie. I, I want to get to that motherfucker right now. The jewel we picked up. What are you looking at? Give all that treasure back! Come off it, kid! This whole desert is my turf! What belongs to the townspeople belongs to me! Now, run along home! If you won't listen to reason... Oh, snap the lamp! <laughs> There's no way you could know how it works! Waluigi... Ark. How did you not do that? Waluigi. Wait, wait, wait! Hold on, hold on! Waluigi. I'll give all the treasure back, every last coin! Please, I am begging you! Uh... Heh, <laughs> heh. Well... Look, I'm... I'm sorry. I'll return all the treasure to the townspeople. War hard. I'm very sorry for what I did. Here is all your treasure back. Shiny. People of next door, I have a little present for all of you. I hope you like the taste of despair. Took the townspeople's faces clean off. Flap! Make the genie of the lamp look like a pushover. Never seen a more dastardly evil mastermind in my life. What's the Dark Lord think he's playing at? He even stole poor Isabel's kisser. You can't just do that to people. She had the sweetest smile of anyone I know. So here's a new song I wrote by myself. It's called Next Door Girls. Well, next door girls are hip. I really dig those faces they wear. Explore a rabbit at your service, self-proclaimed. Lately, I've been mapping out the Great Pyramid for fun and profit. The, the most, it, like, the smartest, most successful person in this entire town is the fucking rabbit. Poor Batman. Once was Iwata but then trained real hard and became Batman. Mike loves nephew Kevin, said Mike gave him a stapler for Christmas once. You can't be serious. What's what's great about having Mike love as the Dark Lord is there's actually real life lore. This is a guy who gives you a stapler for Christmas if he's your uncle. I just noticed you're wearing a new outfit. You look pretty good, said the devil to the scientist. Sounds like a Bob Dylan song. And then the devil complimented. 
The scientists on his outfit. Oh fuck, maybe we can jump into the painting and go into a whole new world. Nikki is now a mountain. Oh. No! But you you can't die. There's there's no one left to possess. We all desire to keep our souls. New skill, playful antics. Oh, this is a very strange thing. I Hotel Mario, I am severely allergic to you and you need to stop that right now. Good shit, my scrub. I'm just gonna leave Hotel Mario like this. I want you to think about, like, Bob Hoskins in the Mario Brothers sequel, where he has to play Mario as a cat. Where will this lead us? To Hotel Mario being thirsty. What is that? A bottle of water? That doesn't look like water, it looks like... Like snake oil. It, it looks like... Indigestion medicine. It was full of sand. <laughs> like, you'd think after the first sip... Nay. As soon as the sand touches your fucking tongue, you would know to stop drinking, but Hotel Mario just gulped and gulped and gulped. No matter how often I stop to fix it, my sock keeps falling down inside my shoe. Why, sock? Why? Lumberjan still has trouble adjusting to being a human. Hotel Mario likes to change his look... ...often. What are you doing? Whoa! Whoa, uh, the leather club is two blocks down. Jesus, fuck, this is like a... ...fucking masochist sex outfit. Oh my god. This entire party is going to become the village people. Do you know what MP stand for? Mutating ponies. <laughs> what? No, why would it stand for mutating ponies? You know, magic and stuff. Transformations. Magic points, it stands for magic points. That's a really weird thing that you would say there, Lumberjan. Every now and then, Lumberjan says something about, like, mutilations and, like, ca cattle mutilations and abductions and probing. And it just, it gives it away. Hey, listen to this. What? So I heard something about Hotel Mario recently. Oh, fuck, rumors? You'd never tell just by looking. How sad. Did someone say my name? Oh my god. <laughs> we all suffer when Speed Luigi sings. Again, it's just the tongue getting in the way. <laughs> faces have been swiped here too. What could the Dark Lord want with all these faces anyway? Well, we're never going to find out. Unless we follow him, after that dog lord! Hang on, my shoes are untied. You don't have shoes, you're in a fucking leather jabroni outfit. It's Luigi in a fucking leather sex outfit. Mario dressed as a cat, and Luigi saying, I wonder what it feels like. It kinda tickles. But it's a bit hard to breathe, and your head goes all fuzzy. It's kind of a warm, fluffy feeling. Whoa! A silver spoon. What are you trying to say with this? Oh no. I'm sorry, Hotel Mario. <laughs> oh fuck! Oh, finally! Look at this thing, this is fantastic! The duality of Jen. Yep, Luigi is a village person. That was the Hitachi magic wand. <laughs> yes, it was! Oh, hey, Batman. Oh, that was an amazing attack. Fuck yeah, poison flask? Can't afford it. Shit. That's not a real microphone speed, Luigi. What are you doing? Oh yeah, thanks for helping me. You gonna have this. The people have got them now, no. It's from Rory the Squid Kid. Here's Devil Vinny. From Sticky Stuff. Ye old cease and desist. Here's one from Spang Boober. It is a two-faced BRB. 
This one's from Vigizilla, and it, I guess, is a thick Klingon. Yes, it is. And here's one with a kabooby, k- kabooby mask. <laughs> kabuki. I swear I meant kabuki. This one's from Vigizilla. Devil Vinny, Cat Hotel Mario, Pop Star Speed Luigi, and Scientist Mike Stoklaza. This one's from Dirty. Some nice Speed Luigi and uh, Hotel Mario. This one's from 1000 Screaming Bees. It's Klingon. The nose looks like a boob. This one's from Panseer. I'm not happy. Mo And Speed Luigi singing, somehow holding a microphone with his tongue. From Panseer. Mike Love, why? And Obiki made this one. That's cool. I, I like how um, Mike Stoklaza looks like Markiplier here. From Panseer. <laughs> I think I, I think you know which one my favorite is from Smoky Feathers. <laughs> no. From M. H. Neuvern. What is this Eldritch Abomination? This one is from Neo Yatado. This is amazing. And there's a lot of detail in this. You could like zoom in and see all the characters. That's cool. Love that Waluigi genie up there. Is that a rabbit? Fuck yeah, it's the rabbit from the town. Um, this one's from Daddy Shivi ninety eight. No. This one's from Panseer, and this is also cool. From HQ Default. Hey, Two Faced, which one of your mouths do you use to eat? You eat with your mouth, weirdo. Oh my god. This whole time I had no idea. This one is from Mr. Grim 23, Hotel Cat Mario. <laughs> from Death in a Cup 879. So is this how it happened? Mike grew a fucking Jan out of his head. Out of his fucking forehead, and then it metastasized. From Munch. Can't avoid copyright laws forever, Vinny. No, Mike Love, stop. You're killing everything that's good and pure in this world. From Pramina. Here's Lumberjan in, in that weird outfit. This one's from Mend Friend. Grew a beard with the power of ketchup. So that's how it happened. From XP Dorito. No. From Corgi MD. Is he trying to be human? Are you sure he is not planting something behind your back? Is his kindness part of his facade? Stop trying to plant seeds. From Spo Tulip. <laughs> Here's uh, another of me as a devil. From Sky the Fox. You seem different. Yeah, the only devil here is, is Vinny. Let's face it. From Kawai Carp. Sorry, Vinisauce. That's how you distinguish between the two. From Kawai Carp 1234. More devil outfit art. From Rubbed A.N. Punished Jen. A man forced to become a Mike. From uh, Mud Guts. That is Goat Vinny. <laughs> from a dose of X shirt. This would go good with my cutlets. From Just Jedi. The rare Satan edgelord Binyot. From Bob Dole Saget. What's wrong Vinny? Don't you like my playful antics? From Cindy M.T. See you at the inn. Jen has left the party. This is fine. From Igor. The devil said to the scientist, hey, nice outfit. From Draco Master 122, fresh water. Look at all that nice water that Mario, that Hotel Mario is consuming. From Robot Fanaticism, Vinisauce, I'm here to help. Jen crawling out of Mike. Poor Mike. That's okay. He, he didn't want to be here anyway. From I, um, Ayana the Dork, Cat Mario, Devil Vinny, Playful Antics. From Napa Kimchi, Punished Jen, a fallen legend. From Lemon Line, still a better story than Twilight. <laughs> from Zeon Dude, there's a Speed Luigi in a Hotel Mayro. This one here is from Ayana the Dork, and it is Leather Bondage, Jabroni Devil Vinny. Thank you for the Lumberjen, Data Spiker. This is from Wigarium Leviosa, and it is Mailcrom. Nice Mailcrom. From Sammy. Here's Devil Vinny. Fred McFrizzle made this. Thank you, Fred. This one here is from Fred McFrizzle as well. Female anatomy test with Two-Face. Just testing my art skills with your characters. It reminds me a lot of Tifa, if you know what I mean. From Just Jedi. I wonder what it feels like. Here's one from Imp Vinny. And uh, it's a little bit more Metopia art. There's the team. Top Tally made this. Dark Lord Mike, a sexy devil, a fat Italian cat, a slow pop star, and a drunk scientist are destroying our forces. From Mika Derps, let me tie my shoe. You don't have shoes in your full leather outfit. This one's from Regular Panties, 
as opposed to non-regular panties. And you have, um, yeah, Devil Vinny, Jabroni specifically. And Purple Shade made Cat Mario nuzzling from Rectal Romance the Third. Here's another Devil Vinny. And from Izazia, another one. From Senoishi, here's Hatsune, Hatsune Miku with your pizza. Want me to perform, Master? Are you kidding me right now? I didn't order Domino's pizza. Do you want... Wait, you want me to put the cheesy on your what? Oh, no. Please don't tell me you actually made a music video for this. This is amazing pixel art, by the way. I'm so sorry, Vinny. I hate this. Whoa! For the legs! <laughs> Stop this! <laughs> I, I like. Oh god, that was good. The ending was good. Does she trip? Like Captain Lou does? Kinda. That's enough internet for one fucking lifetime. Uh, oh my god. Alright. 